Hi, everybody. Welcome to Sing with Susie. Happy Wednesday. It's a beautiful day here in Brooklyn, New York, and I hope that you're having a wonderful day wherever it is that you're watching. And let's see who is watching today. Please go ahead and type in your child's name so that I know who's here so that we can give you a shout out. And in case you haven't heard, we are growing. Sing with Susie is now being viewed and listened to in over 70 countries around the globe. And in March of 2022, we will be celebrating our two year anniversary. So we're very excited about that. And thank you all for continuing to watch and to, for continuing to support the show. Today, we have a very special episode of Play, Create, Build with Wendy from Teaching Beyond the Square. Wendy Gelson Leiter is um, going to be here in just a few minutes to help us and help Cinnamon Bear look inside the beautiful materials trailer to find found materials that might have been recycled or thrown away that can be used for open-ended play. And today we are looking for objects with holes in them and something to go through them. So before we start the show, you can go ahead and look around your home for some items that have holes in them and bring them to the show and see what you can do with them and see if you can find something also to go through them. So that's going to be happening in just a few minutes. Let's go ahead and see who's here. I see that we have many friends watching. We have Augustus is here and Jayla is back. Hi, Jayla. My mom is watching from Charlotte, North Carolina. We have Joanne watching with her mom in from Cork, Carrigline, Ireland. And we also have um, Amber is here. Ivan is here. Epo is out at the moment, but will be coming to watch soon, probably to see Penny. Penny is there ready for her nap. Arnold is here from Chicago. Leora is watching. Hi, Leora. And my mom says that it's 60 degrees there in Charlotte, North Carolina. Ooh, I'm jealous. It's definitely not that warm here, but it is a beautiful sunny day. We have Luca watching. Oh, I'm so happy to see you, Luca. It's been a while. We have Taylor watching. And we have my friend Wendy Gelson later watching, also from Teaching Beyond the Square. Yay, I'm so excited. And Wendy will be sharing with us some ideas and some hints for open-ended play. And in case you're just tuning in, you can go ahead and look around your home for some items that have holes in them and also something to go through them. And that's what we'll be doing in just a few minutes, teaching beyond the square through collaborative partnerships with school communities, works with students, educators, and parents to advance developmentally appropriate best practices, which are more playful, effective, engaging, and equitable. And you can always find out more information on their website, Teaching Beyond the Square. Org. And today we're going to be sharing with you another episode of Play, Create, Build with Wendy. And Cinnamon Bear and I got to go visit Pine Plains, New York, and actually got to go inside the Amazing Materials trailer. And we'll be showing that to you in just a little bit. Let's go ahead and get started with some music. So today I wanted to start with the song about it being such a beautiful day because it had been so cold and so snowy and rainy the last couple of days and windy that I thought it would be a good idea to do a song called It's a Beautiful Day. Now, if you have any dancing scarves with you that you wanna use, go ahead and get them ready. If you have any shakers there, go ahead and get those ready. And of course, if you have an instrument that you wanna play along like I do, go ahead and play along with me. Here we go. It's a beautiful day, I wish I could play Behind my house, outside with my friends It's a beautiful day, so what do you say? Do you want to come over so the fun never ends? It's a beautiful day Sun shines on my face in the grass It tickles my toes you spy a butterfly and it lands right on the tip of my nose. Clouds look like cotton balls and the sky is as blue as the sea. I turn to take your hand and your hands are ready reaching out for me. 
It's a beautiful day. I wish I could play behind my house, outside with my friends. It's a beautiful day. So what do you say? Do you want to come over so the fun never ends? It's a beautiful day. Ba ba da, ba ba da, ba ba da, ba da ba da, ba ba da ba ba. I feel like someone has set me free, free to run, free to jump, free to just be me. So nice to share this feeling with you. Bees buzzing around the flowers and buttercups dancing the breeze. You tell me your funny jokes, you know, laughing always makes me sneeze at you. Bells ring from the ice cream top, and we've got a few dollars to spare. Race you to the top of the hill, and I know that you will beat me there. But I don't care. It's a beautiful day. I wish I could play behind my house, outside with my friends. It's a beautiful day. So what do you say? It's a beautiful day. It's beautiful day. It's beautiful day. Thank you, friends. Thank you for tuning in. If you're just joining us, welcome to Sing with Susie and happy Wednesday. Today, we have a very special episode of Play, Create, Build with Wendy. Wendy Gelsenleiter is here from Teaching Beyond the Square. And Teaching Beyond the Square is actually the sponsors of Sing with Susie this month. And they help children think outside of the box. And if you want to find out more information, you can always go to their website, teachingbeyondthesquare.org. They have wonderful tips for teachers and parents and, of course, for children and allow open-ended play to happen with materials that you could find in your own home. And today, we're actually looking for items in your home that have holes in them and something to go through it. So let's go ahead. Let me just check in with the comments here. We have so many friends joining us today. It's so great to see you all. And we're going to go ahead. Oh, I see some friends are already typing in some items that you have around your house that have holes in them. Wonderful. Go ahead and you can keep typing that in throughout the segment. And let's go ahead and get started with Wendy and Cinnamon Bear and Teaching Beyond the Square in the materials trailer. Here we go. We're back again with Wendy Gelsenleiter and Teaching Beyond the Square, and we're here again in Pine Plains, New York, Hi, Cinnamon Bear. in the wonderful materials trailer. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> Yay! Cinnamon was so excited doing? to come back, and you know why? why? Because there are so many amazing objects that were found that weren't thrown away and that weren't recycled that we're going to discover today. Yeah. And cinnamon is going to look any for shape objects, but they have to have a hole in them. That's right. That's right. And then something to go through that hole. So let's go ahead and take a look at the amazing objects in the materials trailer. And friends at home, you're going to be bringing things that you found in your home. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, we're back. Cinnamon, you found all of these items with holes in them and some items to put through the holes. Let's see what you found. Cinnamon Bear, you found a lot. Yes, you did. Let's count. One, two, three, four, and five. Oh look at gosh. all of them. I'm going to look at you now through this big hole. Can I see you? Hello there. And you found two things that can go through these holes. One is, surprise, surprise, a green piece of yarn. And the second, this is called, I don't know if you even know this, but you picked it up. <laughs> this is called a twist tie. And this twist tie was found around some vegetables at the grocery store. Yes. Let's see if they go through this hole. And it's so cool. Let's see if it'll go through this. Do you think this twist tie will go through this big hole? Yeah, yeah. let's try it. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, oh there, there it is. is. Now it how is. about this let's little try this one. square? It looks like it has holes in it. It has holes in it. Does it go through? And oh, oh, there oh, it is. Let's do that again. Oh, oh, there oh. it is. How about this one? <laughs> this oh, one. let's this see. Piece. Good it job. disappears for just a little bit and then it comes back. Now look at this one. This actually used to be the top of a plastic bottle. They cut it right off. Let's see. Let's see if it goes through. Oh, oh maybe no. try the other way. Oh, it fits right on top though. It's on top. And you know what else? Look, I bet this will go through. Let's see. Here it comes. Here it comes. Oh! It went oh. through! It went now through! Now you know, let's see, I have an idea. Let's see if I can put this through here. Oh, are you holding my here, arm? Here, you can try it here, Cinnamon. Hold you can that. hold that side. Okay, now let's hold this together. Let's see through this hole. Oh. <gasps> hold on, let's do another one. Let's try, let's see if that can go, if this has holes that will go through. Oh, stuck. Can't do that one. Let's try this one. Let's see. Do you think it's gonna go through? Let's try. Let's try. So these materials are reminding me that we get donations from all kinds of people. Look at that. Look. And if we had more objects with holes, we could string them through there. Put it on like a necklace. Oh, look at that. We get these materials from all kinds of people. People like you and me, mm -hmm. different businesses all over New York City. Yes. So if you are a business and you want to donate some of your materials, you can find out more information on where to donate also on teachingbeyondthesquare.org. That's right? right. Absolutely. And then we sort them and we put them in our material center and we put them on our trailer. Yes. So that children and adults can play, create, and build with them. Just like you are. <laughs> yes. So see you next time. See you next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>
Um, my mom says a colander to a strainer. That's a great one to use. Great one. I found some other items here that have holes in them. I found these shakers. There's a hole in them. And I also found a ribbon so that I can put it through the shaker. And maybe I want to play it that way. Or I also found the top of a jam jar, probably some jam or some sauce made by my mother-in-law. And then this is also some blue tape. We always have blue tape in this house because um, I'm married to somebody who's very handy. And look, you can go like this, like Cinnamon Bear did. We can even use maybe the same ribbon through both of them. And we can make something that moves this way. So many different items and so many different ways to use them. So thank you so much um, to Wendy for sharing that with us. And please check them out at teachingbeyondthesquare.org. You can find tips for teachers and children and parents and much more engagement on their website to tell you um, different ways to have open-ended play with found materials in your home that might be thrown out or might be recycled. But if you hang on to them, you can use them in so many different ways. All right, let's keep going. I have a couple of <laughs> a couple of song requests, but I do have a song that I wanted to prepare for you today. So I'm not sure if we're going to get to all of the song requests, but what I wanted to ask you is for this next song, what is your favorite way to get around? Perhaps it's a bike. Perhaps it's roller skates. Perhaps you like to walk on your feet. I actually like walking. I prefer walking. Perhaps you like driving or riding in a car. Or perhaps you like riding in a scooter. And this next song is called Scooter Boy. And throughout this song, if you would please comment what is your favorite way to get around? And let us know how you like to get around where you live. And this song was written a long time ago when my son was very small, maybe around seven, and he would get around town on his scooter everywhere. And you had to just get out of his way because he was very fast. So this is called Scooter Boy. <laughs> Apart from head to toe, other kids they want to be you. I see you on my way to school. I always do right by me. You are so fast and that's so cool. I long to be that carefree. Oh, just love the scooter boy. Scoot, scoot, scooter boy. Look at me, watch me go. Speed is my new middle name, don't you know? Can't go fast enough. Watch out with the crowd is slow. Every day you can. Watch us go, speed is our new middle name, don't you know? Can't go fast enough, watch out with the crowd is slow. Every day you can hear me shout, let's go! 
shout, let's go. And every day you can hear us shout, let's go. <laughs> Yay. Aw, thank you for your comments, friends. Those are some great ways to get around. You can slide on the floor. You can ride your bicycle. You can travel in an airplane. You can travel in a car. You can walk or you can ride your scooter. Great. <laughs> so I wanted to let everybody know of a very special show coming up on Monday. I have my friends, Caitlin and Tommy from the Alphabet Rockers will be here and they're going to be sharing with us their brand new book, which just arrived in the mail today. And this book is called You Are Not Alone. And it's also an incredible music video. And it's illustrated by Ashley Evans. And I'll show you the back cover here. There's Tommy and Caitlin from the Alphabet Rockers. There's Ashley. And it's a wonderful story, a wonderful book for everyone. It's beautifully illustrated and they're going to be sharing it on Monday's show. So I'm really excited for them to come on the show on Monday. And we have an incredible lineup happening this year. This year is going to be our two-year anniversary in March. And wait till you see the amazing lineup of the special guests that I have coming up this year. It's going to be so much fun. So thank you so much for joining me. And let's see if we have time. I think we have time for one song request. So Taylor, I think we have time for Tomboy and a Princess Dress. Let me just see if I can find it. It's been a few minutes. Oh, I think we can do it. All right. So all friends who are out there who like to dress up in costume, any kind of costume, who like to climb trees, who like to dig in the dirt, who like to paint their arms and elbows, this song is for you. This song is Tomboy in a Princess Dress. And let's see if you can clap your hands to the beat. There you go. Tallest tree top, barefoot without a care. Tough as nails and fast as lightning. Braids and ribbons in my hair. Flips and cartwheels, I adore them. Kickball and karate, too. I never cared too much for ballet. All I wanted was a pink tutu. Cause I'm a tomboy in a princess dress. A little secret that I must confess A combination that surely impressed Cause I'm a tomboy in a pretty, pretty princess dress Pretty, 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 pretty princess dress Pretty, 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 pretty. I can jump into the deep end Get my face wet, I don't care Finger paint my arms and elbows Color flying everywhere Dogs and kittens, they all love me. Little tiny babies too. I ride my horse and barely hold on. Get to know me and you know it's true. Cause I'm a tomboy in a princess dress. A little secret that I must confess. A combination that will surely impress. Cause I'm a tomboy in a pretty, pretty princess dress. Pretty, 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 pretty princess dress. Pretty, 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 pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty princess dress. Pretty, 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 pretty. Here we go. <laughs> I can run circles around the boys. Dig in the dirt and make some noise. Dig in the dirt with my bare hands. The faster the better, the scary whatever. You know I can take it, you know that I can. Cause I'm a tomboy in a princess dress. A little secret that I must confess. A combination that will surely impress. Cause I'm a tomboy in a pretty, pretty princess dress. Tomboy in a princess dress No, not a helpless damsel in distress A combination that is gonna impress Cause I'm a tomboy in a pretty, pretty princess dress Pretty, 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 pretty princess dress Pretty, 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 pretty Pretty, 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 pretty princess dress Pretty, 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 pretty 
you, everybody. Thank you for that song request, Taylor. And a special thank you to my friend Wendy Gelsenleiter and Teaching Beyond the Square for sharing all of her amazing ideas with us. And thank you for participating. And I can't wait to see what you will do at home with your objects that you found that have holes in them. And maybe you can find something to go through the holes. And let's see where it takes you. We'll see everybody again on Monday when I'll have my friends Caitlin and Tommy here from the Alphabet Rockers talking about their new book and new visit music video you are not alone. So I hope everybody is having a wonderful rest of their afternoon. Penny and I and Cinnamon Fair are sending you so much love and so much support and so much positive energy today from our couch in our living room in Brooklyn to wherever it is that you're watching. And we'll see you all again on Monday. Bye, everyone.